Good morning again, it's Quinton, Cut It Right Tree Service. Here we are in Frankston, opposite the uh, beautiful Botanic Gardens there. Um, we've just got a tree here. The neighbours lived over the other side of the fence here for at least 30 years. He's told me that the tree got cut down many years ago, which I've already identified. He said, um, when I told him about my um, observation of the tree, he said, you know what, you're correct. It was cut down about 20 odd years ago. So what we have here, this tree, Sorry about that. I'll just go in and have you look. Have a look. You can see that this tree has been lopped many years ago, um, and it's growing off with all these codominant epicormic leaders that grow like fishing rods. They grow straight up, 100 miles an hour, straight to the sky. So they have a very high potential to fail due to the the, the stump that was probably cut down around about that height. <coughs> The stump is rotting in the ground. So what you have is a rotting stump with all these new epicormic growth coming off and that, that, that are gonna fail. As, as we all know, stumps rot. There's a lot of insects and moisture in the ground. That's why the stumps rot. And, and then now you've got these huge, probably, oh, must be eight, 10, 10 metre high epicormics growing up. So they are going to fail. So we'll be able to get a permit from the Frankston Council due to um, the, the problematic problem that this will be. I mean, this, this could fail next week, most likely not, but it's gonna fail sooner than later. So what we've got to do is get onto the problem. We could probably cut, the, cut these down to gutter height instead of removing the whole tree, but the customer's uh, done that about six years ago. He's come and engaged with uh, another tree company, not myself, and I can see where these have been all these branches here have been cut back and then it's shot off with epicormic growth again. So you can see that branch just up there has been cut off and it's grown into multiple, it's got, it's got multiple trunks coming off. So I can see where it's been cut to the fence line. So he's had it cut to the fence line previously. Six years later, got to do it again. Another six years later, got to do it again. So. He's sick of that. He said he'd like the tree to be removed. So I found the problems that we should be able to get them removed. So we'll just go through the council regulation, permit application, um, and we'll, we'll see how we go. We may need an arborist report. Um, well, there you go. So another tree um, inspection um, at the Frankston Shire. Um, give us a call if you'd like, to, like me to drop around and inspect your trees. Thank you.